Hello, I want to welcome you to my channel. My name is Bob Speakman. This is the Awkward Bob channel. Normally I do a daily video called the Daily Awkward Bob, and you can check that out while you're here. But if you've come here specifically for a Google Chromecast tip video, then you're in luck. If you haven't seen my Google Chromecast setup video, I'll put a link in the description and also up above. If you have, and that's where you've come from, I've got another tip and trick for you. Today I'm going to teach you how to literally cast anything from your cell phone or your other mobile device, tablet, etc. That's right. I'm going to show you how to cast literally anything to your device. So I'm going to, I'm going to show you on my tablet. Now the first step for you is to make sure you go and download the Google Home app. If you want to hit pause on the video, Go ahead and do so now, and I'll be here when you get back. Got it? All right. So if you have the Google Home app, this process could not be simpler. I'm going to show you how to do it first in my hand, and then I'll do a little screen share so we can go through it step by step once again. It's very simple. Now, the key to sharing anything from a device to the Chromecast is that both the device and your Chromecast they're both going to have to be on the same Wi-Fi network so if you only have one Wi-Fi network that's not a problem obviously they'll be on the same if you have multiple like a, some sort of Wi-Fi router where there's different connections you connect to make sure both are connected okay the second thing now you can you can cast at any point to, to most streaming apps um, you can cast via even the, the Chrome browser. Uh, you go into Netflix or uh, YouTube and that little cast image shows up right in the top right part of your screen. You know that you're good to go and you can cast that way. But how do you cast anything else? Literally anything else onto your screen. Well you start out, let's get into the app. Once you open up the Google Home app, you'll see the applications that you have installed currently on your device that are compatible with the Chromecast. So we've got YouTube, Netflix, Google Play, Movies and TV, Vudu. It'll show some of your other apps and then also recommend apps that are that you can use with the Chromecast. But that doesn't help you with what you want to do via this video, which is cast literally anything from your device. So to do that, on the top left, you'll see the three lines. Click it, and it'll bring you up to your settings or your options menu. All you have to do at this point is click the button that says cast screen and audio. It'll ask you where you want to cast. This is to the bedroom TV that I have set up. Now let's see what happens. So I have a hit cast to the bedroom TV. I move this down and voila, there's the bedroom TV. So literally everything that's on this is now on this. So that means even if I turn the tablet to the side, it'll reorient the screen to show the exact same thing. So no matter what I do, so if I go ahead and pull up another app, So now I'm controlling the earth from my tablet. Now, there are a few drawbacks. Streaming via this method is not going to work out great for you. The picture is going to be digitized um, most of the time and it'll struggle to, to keep up. But in most applications, especially when you're trying to show somebody pictures or show somebody something on a web browser or just an app that you're playing this will do the trick so your hand or your tablet rather becomes the mouse and you can whatever you do on the tablet I'm going to zoom in it's going to happen on the TV and you see the little bit of digitizing but that happens on the the app itself as well as it tries to catch up. 
and zoom way out and spin the earth. Thanks for watching this Google Chromecast tips and tricks video. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. Um, link in the description to the Google Chromecast setup video. And we'll have more Google Chromecast tips and tricks coming to you soon. Thank you so much for stopping by. Again, my name is Bob Speakman. I do a daily vlog, Daily Awkward Bob. We'll put a link as well in the description so you can see the playlist of all my daily videos. I literally make a video every day. How many times can I use the word literally in one video? Literally a ton. Thank you. Have a great day.